Now, the, the main benefit of Blender compared to commercial software is, of course, the price. Uh, that's what people say. Blender is free, not only free as a free software, but it's free as in uh, gratis and no money, which is a good reason for people uh, to be curious about it. But in the end, uh, if they use Blender for a while, they c understand that free software, open source software, means a lot more. And if you compare something like Maya or Max with Blender, I think Maya or Max offer you lots of really advanced, high quality uh, technology, but because it's closed, it's not your stuff. So you can press some buttons, and if you are luck, it will do what you want it to do. But because it's closed, you are always uh, shut away from the actual technology. So in Blender, it is your stuff. And if it doesn't work, you can fix it. Or you can ask somebody to help fixing it. Or you can help improving it. So the, the control over your own technology is for many people more important than the quality of the technology. And I think that's the same thing as why you guys are making your own camera system. Because it's the fact that it's your camera is probably more important for you than the fact that you have a really good camera. Of course, you want to have both. But if you buy a camera, yeah, then what? Huh? You, if you are lucky, it's a really good system, and you press the buttons, and you, you might get out of it what Sony wants you to do with the camera, but that might be not what you actually want. Right? So that's why Blender is definitely much better than any other of the competition, because of the openness, and not so much because of the free part.